ವಂದೇ ಗುರುಪದ್ವಂದ ಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಸಮನ್ವಿತ ಶ್ರೀಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ವಂದೆ ನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಸಹೋದಿತ ಶ್ರೀನಂದನಂದನ ವಂದೆ ರಾಧಿಕ ಚರಣೋದ ಗೋಪೀಜನ ಸಮಯುತ ಬಿಂದಾವನ ಮನೋಹರ ವಾಂಚಾಕಲ್ಪತರು ಕಿಪಾಸಿಂದವಚ ಪತಿ ಪಾವನೆಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ಮೂಕಂಕರೋತಿ ವಾಚಾಲಂಗುಂಘಯತಗಿರ ಯತ್ಕಿಪಾತಮಹಂ ವಂದೇ ಪರಮಾನಂದಮಾಧವ ಬೃಂದಾವಯಿ ತುಳಸಿದೇವೈ ಪಿಯಾವೈ ಕೇಶವ ಸ್ನಭಕ್ತಿಪದೆ ದೇವೀ ಸತ್ವತ್ವೈ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ನಾರಾಯಣ ನಮಸ್ಕೃತ ನರಂಜೈವ ನರೋತ್ತಮ ದೇವೀಂ ಸ್ವರಸ್ವತಿ ವ್ಯಾಸ ತಥೋ ಜಯೋ ಮುದೇ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೆ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಕಥೋಪದೇಶೆ ಗೌರೀಯ ಪತ್ರಶ್ಯ ಪ್ರಕಾಶನೆ ಚ ಸದಾನುರಕ್ತ ಗುರುಭಕ್ತಿಯುಕ್ತ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಪ್ರಮದಾಕ್ಷ ಜಗೋದ್ವರು ಧೈಯ ಸದಾ ಪರಿಭವಗ್ನಮಿಷ್ಟೂಹಂ ತೀರ್ಥಾಸ್ಪದ ಶಿವಿರಂಚನು ತಂ ಶರಣ್ಯಂ ಭೀತಾಕ್ತಿಹಂ ಪುನತುಪಾಲಭವಾಧಿಪೂತ ವಂದೇ ಮಹಾಪುರುಷ ತೇ ಚರುನಾರವಿಂದ ಯತ್ಪಾದಲ್ಲವನಕಚಂದಮನಿಟಾಯ ವಿಸ್ಫುರ್ಜೀತ ಕಿಮಿ ಗೋಪವಧೂಷ್ವದರ್ಶಿ ಪೂರ್ಣಾನುರಾಗರಸಸಾಗರ ಸಾರಮೂರ್ತಿ ಸಾರಾಧಿಕಾಮಯಿ ಕದಾ ಕಿಫಾಕರೋಷಿ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಸ್ಯಾದೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಸ್ಯಾದೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಅಜಾನುಲಂಬಿತ ಭುಜೌ ಕನಕಾವುದಾತು ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೈಕವಿತರು ಕಮಲಾಯತಾಕ್ಷು ವೀಶಾಂಬರೂ ದ್ವಿಜರೂ ಜುಗಧರ್ಮಪಾಲು ವಂದೇ ಜಗತ್ ಪ್ರಿಯಕರು ಕರ್ಕರುಣಾಂಬತಾರು ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ನಮಿ ಗಂಗೇ ತವ ಪಾದ ಪಂಕಜ ಸುರಸುರೈರ್ವಂದಿತೋ ದಿವ್ಯೂಪ ಭುಕ್ತಿ ಚ ಮುಕ್ತಿ ದಿ ನಿತ್ಯ ಭಾನ್ ರೂಪೇಣ ಸದಾ ನರಾನ ಗಂಗಾತರಂಗರಮಣೀಯ ಜಟಾಕಲಾಫ ಗೌರೀ ನಿರಂತರ ವಿಭೂಷಿತ ವಾಮ ಭಾಗ ನಾರಾಯಣ ಪ್ರಿಯ ಮನಂಗ ಮದಾಪಹಾರ ವರಾನಸಿ ಪುರಪತಿ ಭಜ ವೀಶ್ವನಾಥ ವಾಗೀಶಜುಷ್ವದನೆ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮೀರ್ಜಸ್ಸ ಚಕ್ಷಸಿ ಜಸ್ಸಾಸ್ತಿ ಹೃದಯ ಸಂಬೀರ್ ಸಿಂಗಮಹಂ ಭಜೆ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ 
गौरांगैक गति बजास्तमति श्री गौरधाम स्थिति सात्सैकतिर्गुसंग विरती दुस्त व्यथा निष्कृति श्रीरूपैकती सनातन नती श्रीजीवते जोस्ति श्री सिद्धांत सरस्वती विजयते गौरीय गोष्ठीपति श्री सिद्धांत सरस्वती विजयते गौरीय गोष्ठीपति गौरीय गोष्ठीपति श्री शिल भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी ठाकुर प्रभुपाद यूज टू से दैट टू बिकम वेरी एजुटेटेड इन द ह्यूमिलिएशन ऑफ गुरु वैष्णव इज कॉल्ड वैष्णविज्म गौरीय गोष्ठीपति श्री शिल भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी ठाकुर प्रभुपाद यूज टू से दैट टू बिकम वेरी एजुटेटेड in the humiliation of guru vaishnava is called vaishnavism if at all proper relationship with guru vaishnava sadhu guru vaishnava can be discovered in that case it is quite impossible for anybody to insult pure साधु गुरु वैष्णव मे बी रिलेशनशिप इज नॉट डेवलप्ड एज येट गुरु तथा इज अनडिवाइडेड तथा एट द सेम टाइम आई टोल दैट इट इज सिंगल तथा सिंगल अनडिवाइडेड तथा गुरु तथा इज अनडिवाइडेड एंड सिंगल तथा सेम Guru Tatha, I mean that unique Guru Tatha can appear in different form in front of different people. Maybe in my life, that Guru Tatha has come in the form of Sela Bhakti Pramod Puri Goshi Maharaj. Maybe in your life, Guru Tatha has has come in the form of Sela Parampuja Keshav Goshi Maharaj. बस दिस मच डिफरेंस नथिंग एल सेम यूनिक था एक्चुअली प्रोपाद यूज टू से दैट बलदाव जी महाराज आकर गुरु तत्व कमिंग इन दिस मेटेरियल वर्ल्ड इन डिफरेंट फॉर्म एपियर इन दिस मेटेरियल वर्ल्ड इन डिफरेंट फॉर्म टू डेलीवर ऑल बाउंडेड सोल्स जनस्व कृष्णाद विमुख से दैवाद धर्म शील से सुदुख्य तस्व अनुग्रहाय अनुग्रहाय चरती नून भूता भव्या जनार्दन से जन सृष्णाद विमुख से दैवाद अधर्मशील से सुदुखित अनुग्रहाय चरती नून भूता भव्या जनार्दन से माय गुरुदेव योर गुरुदेव हिज गुरुदेव दिस इज नॉट एक्चुअली गुरु दर्शन दिस इज नॉट एक्चुअली गुरु दर्शन बी केयरफुल माय गुरुदेव योर गुरुदेव हिज गुरुदेव दिस इज नॉट एक्चुअली गुरु दर्शन इट इज एक्चुअली लोघु दर्शन इट इज एक्चुअली द दर्शन ऑफ बॉन्डेड सोल If perfect Guru Darshan is beyond realization still today, then surely my dikha is not complete as yet. If perfect, exact Guru Tattva is beyond realization still today in front of me, in that case. हरि भजन कैन नॉट स्टार्ट हरि भजन कैन ओनली स्टार्ट आफ्टर रियलाइजेशन ऑफ गुरु दत्त नॉट रियलाइजेशन आफ्टर फीलिंग डायरेक्टली वायर इज गुरु तत्थ दिस इज द परफेक्ट सनातन विचार ऑफ शिला पहुपाद 
this is the this is the perfect सिद्धांत विचार ऑफ शिला भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी जगत भोपाल वेन माइ पुष्पांजलि ऑन टू द लोटस पीट ऑफ योर गुरुदेव वेन माइ पुष्पांजलि ऑन टू द लोटस पीट ऑफ योर सदगुरुदेव कैन ऑटोमेटिकली रीच ऑन टू द लोटस पीट ऑफ माइ सदगुरुदेव माइ गुरु चरण देन my puspanjali is perfect any amount of flowers any amount of you know you know efforts is just useless i cannot complete my guru puja it is not possible with this you know narrow darshan so when my puspanjali unto the lotus feet of your sadguru dev can automatically reach unto the lotus feet of my sadguru dev then my puspanjali unto the lotus feet of guru dev is per- perfect is done rightly an unique scope an unique scope we can get through guru vishnup seva and their glory and their glory begins to sing their glorification we can get unisco of seva guru vishnu of seva and we can get the scope to glorify their name and fame it is topmost bhajan mode police people they cannot understand this is the perfect siddhant of all authentic scriptures including simad bhagavatam sila pahopad used to speak that way we can go through the following shlokas to clarify clarify the point to discover the universal truth avoiding all narrow sectarian attitude actually this is the perfect siddhant of all authentic scriptures including simad bhagavatam etc we can go through the following shlokas to clarify the point to discover the universal truth avoiding all narrow sectarian attitude you can remember many time before i used to speak this shloka srutas sapungsam suchira samasya नौनोंजसुरीर्थ तत्तुनासवन मुकुंद पदारविंद हृदय सुजेशम श्रीमद्भागवजी महापुराण फास्ट कैंटो टू चैप्टर थर्टी थ्री श्लोक इन साइड द हार्ट ऑफ दोज पारमहस साधुगुरु वैष्णव सुप्रीम लॉर्ड ऑलवेज रेस्टिंग वेरी पीसफुली वैष्णवर हृदय सदा गोविंद विश्राम पर हैव यू हैव गॉन थ्रू दिस कीर्तन गोविंद कहन वैष्णव और प्राण भक्त हृदय सदा गोविंद विश्राम इन साइड द हार्ट ऑफ दोज परमहस गुरु वैष्णव सुप्रीम लॉर्ड ऑलवेज रेस्टिंग द लोट स्पीड ऑफ सुप्रीम लॉर्ड इज देयर सो विदाउट टेकिंग एनी ट्रैवल for long period to go through different scriptural scriptural analysis like ved vedanta upanishad etc if we can serve them i mean those guru vaishnav and they, and we can if we can uh, if we can sing their glories then very easily we can attain our goal of perfection we forget this point why are necessarily you are going to take travel to go through all different shastras these that ved vedanta upanishad to project yourself as a great great pandit you want to project yourself as great great pandit erudite scholar actually you don't know inside the heart of those pure guru vaishnavas the lotus feet of supreme lord is always there supreme lord always resting inside their heart so we are so without taking any trouble for long period 
to go through different scriptural analysis like ved vedanta etc if you can serve them those guru vaishnav your guru vaishnav and if we can if we can try to sing the glories of the those guru vaishnav then very easily we can attain our goal of perfection another sloka i would like to speak idam hi pungs idam hi pungs has tapas ha srutas srutas sava sishtas suktas cha buddha dattayo अविच्युत अर्थ कविर निरूपित यदुत्तम श्लोक गुणान वर्णनम इदम ही इदम ही पुंस तपस श्रुतस्वा शिष्ट सूक्त बुद्ध दत्त अविच्युत अर्थ कविर निरूपित यदुत्तम श्लोक गुणान वर्णनम श्रीमद भागवजी महापुराण फास्ट कैंटो फिफ्थ चैप्टर ट्वेंटी टू श्लोक Sila Naraji Maharaj is speaking in front of Sri Basa Deva Goswami ji that the ultimate result I mean nitya phal the ultimate result nitya phal or the outcome of all our efforts to do austerities and penances and bed paths reciting veda or doing jagya or reciting divine kind of mantra hymns from ved upanishad to develop gyana and dan dan etc donation etc we can do but the ultimate nitya phal of all those activities is to glorify the supreme lord uttam shloka and uttam shloka already means bhagavat tattva vigyan mukta sangasya je pariyate i mean adhyayan tattva is total you know bhagavat dham naam parikar vaishishtya leela etc all in together we can get adhyay gantatta adhyay gantat that adhyay gantatta doesn't mean i can cut all devotees outside and keep only supreme lord which is quite impossible if i can go on singing name fame and pastimes of supreme lord and his devotees because if, if you can go through bhagavatam you can see from fast cantro you can find all the glories of guru vishnu ultimately on 10th cantro you can give, you can get the scope to hear all about you know exceptional glories of supreme lord and his leelas so to glorify the supreme lord i mean the name and fame and pastimes and leelas of supreme lord and to glorify his devotees this has been the extract specified by all those pandits that is the net outcome of all your activities that you have that you have done in your life what this has been the extract of all shastras specified by all those pandits so also sila jiva goswami pad has written in his bhakti sandarbha that guru va ganya tat sevan avirodhena cha annesham upi vaishnavanam sevanam shreya guru va ganya tat sevan avirodhena cha annesham upi vaishnavanam sevanam shreya what does it mean this means that with the permission of gurudev we can go we can also serve we can go to serve other guru vaishnavs to get advantage in bhajan provided provided the main stream of seva of my gurudev is not disturbed in that case by the consent by the permission of 
Gurudev, we can also serve other Guru Vaishnav. So, in this respect, I would like to clarify this point with the help of a sloka pointed out by Srila Rupa Goswami Pad in Bhakti Rasamrita Sindhu. Sajati Rasa is Snigde Sadhu Sangu Satu Vare. Sajati Rasa is Snigde Sadhu Sangu Satu Vare. This means that Sampradayik, own Sampradayik, senior Sadhu Sangha is very useful. Superior Sadhu, his Sangha, this kind of Sangha association is much more beneficial. Because of some, because of same Baba and same Go. Because of same Baba, Sampradayak Baba. Because of same Baba and same Gola. But also we can, serve, we can also serve other Sampradayak Sadhu provided this seva not going to lose my faith in my own sampradaya. This is also good. I used to go to take the association of big, big sadhu in Ramanuja sampradaya here, there. But I was always careful. I was very careful. Ah. So that I am not going to lose my own position. Also, you can remember, Mayabad Shastra is totally prohibited. Really so. Mayabad Shastra is so dangerous, you cannot get bhakti, you can lose bhakti. But what happens when big, big Guru Varga going, going to follow, not actually follow, when they want to search all Mayabad Shastra, to find some point to defend own vichar, sampradayak vichar, then there is no problem. But common people, for common devotees, weak devotees is strictly prohibited. So, sajati rasa snigde sadhu sangu satu vare. This means, own sampradayak sadhu, I mean superior senior sadhu, his Sangha association is much more beneficial because of same Baba and same goal. This is the most vital Siddhanta of all authentic Shastra scriptures, including Srimad Bhagavatam, or Sri Chaitanya Charitamrita, etc. That Sadhu Sangha is the most effective part in the way of, way of your Hari Bhajan. And ultimately, this Sadhu Sangha is also very effective for ever, even in Siddha stage. Even in Siddha stage. So that Sadhu Sangha is the most effective part to play in, your, in the way of your Hari Bhajan. That is why we can see the following vichar from Chaitanya Charitamrita. Krishna Bhakti Janma Mool Hoy Sadhu Sangha. The very root cause of your Krishna Bhakti is Sadhu Sangha. Be careful. Also, we can find from Sri Chaitanya Charitamrita, Sadhu Sangha, Sadhu Sangha, Sarva Shastri Koi, Labamatto Sadhu Sangha, Sarva Siddhi Hoi. In spite of all those countless support of Siddhanta, Siddhanta Vichar, Vicharavali, of all different authentic scriptures, in spite of all this positive argument, who can say? That don't go for Sadhu Sangha, don't go to Goryamat, don't go to get the association of any Gorya Sadhu, don't go, try to avoid the invitation, don't pay any dandava to their deities. Who can say, except a demon? Who can say, except a demon? Who can say this way? Actually, Sometimes some devotees used to ask Prabhupada, Prabhupada, we like to go there to attend Harikatha. Papa said, don't go. Actually, Prabhupada wanted to, wanted to stop them going there. 
because that is asasanga that is asasanga that's why prabhu was we don't go there sometime prabhu was speaking somebody some devotee is taking permission prabhu pad we like to go to take darshan of sila gaur kishor das bhai mar all later on uh, the darshan of sil actually the darshan of bangshidas baba ji maharaj popa ji used to say no don't go there you can misunderstand them you cannot you cannot understand their activities that is the only reason that is the only reason popa ji used to give this kind of ad- advice don't go here and there don't rely don't try to rely on each and every source of hari katha why because each and every source is not authentic perfect what popas wanted to say we should understand popas used to speak that at least at least we can at least we can go to such a place where we can we can we can go to such a place where at least nama purad is not going on most of the place there is nam aparad going on hari katha is almost rare at present hari katha coming from heart hari katha appear from the transcendental world transcendental world on the tongue of those pure devotees so popad wanted to give us advice to rely on exact source of hari katha like i told you many time that somebody some patient speaking to doctor doctor going to ayurvedic doctor speaking he should not take any ganja he should not take any anything which is very bad he must take cheese he must take fruits he must take milk everything curd but that person speaking well i can follow your advice at the same time you will have to give me permission to take gaja also without gaja i cannot live that is a situation those who want to get pure association how they can go for bad association how to identify what is bad association what is good association i already answered many time is an automatic factor one kind of radar one kind of detecting power can appear inside your heart when you can go on hearing pure sadguru vishnu then at the same time if some day some day if you go to attend such hari katha you can readily understand it is not hari katha it is not hari katha so prabhupad used to advise us to rely on proper source of hari katha vaikuntha katha we can hear or at least if there is no vaikuntha katha there should not be any naam aparad naam aparad in the name of hari katha hari bhajan hari katha if there is naam aparad going on if you go and try to get their association then what will happen you will have to think over and again so that is why jibo goshai pad also speaking in bhakti sandarbha there that we should not give the seat of basasan to each and everybody we cannot allow bhakta sarag nirag divido parikirtita two types of bhakta speaker there one was a self sent to collect name and fame position everything is going to speak hari katha this kind of bhakta can contaminate all your heart you cannot get any benefit what to speak about benefit you are going to lose your bhajan and another type of bhakta without any self interest even somebody going to speak we can kill you still he is going to speak the same absolute truth like prabhupad used to declare that if the whole world going against me still i am going to speak about that same absolute truth standing under the umbrella of guru pad padma charan i cannot change my standpoint standpoint i can go on speaking about 
the same absolute shot so you can remember the shlok from padma puran avaishnava mukhad giram hari katham ritam savanam nayo kartavya sarpachist jatha payo milk is very ideal food we know but if somehow some snack coming inside your room and drinking some milk you don't know unknowingly you are going to drink that milk say so you are going to die who can protect you so you will have to select right source of hari katha if you want to maintain your hari bhajan name fame position glamour you want to get in your life so you cannot avoid bad association in any form in any form you are going to get bad association you cannot avoid it so if there is 100% resolution in your life that i must go for satsanga never i can go for satsanga in that case it can be possible so because then you, you can get divine help from guru varga and supreme lord nitananda also sri guru vaishnav i mean sat guru vaishnav can always reserve the right of not being exposed to our sense organs that i told before that sri that guru vaishnav also supreme lord can reserve can always reserve the right of not being exposed to our sense organs except real except except, uh, except you know uh, guru vaishnav can exhibit two type of sarup one is the secret sarup which is very secret real sarup and another is banchanama depriving saru guru vaishnav is very clever if they find you a cheater guru vaishnav is a cheater of the cheater cheater of the cheaters that they can also cheat you you think you are very clever na you are very intelligent bhakti mun thakur think bhakti mun thakur writing each and everybody think i am very intelligent really bhakti mun thakur speaking really they are all intelligent but they are intelligent according to their own estimation not according to the estimation of supreme lord that's why in front of uddhav ji uddhav ji maharaj krishna bhagwan speaking ye uddhav who is intelligent who is intelligent and who is not ah uh, bhagwan sri krishna speaking that he is actually intelligent who is going to protect his life who is going to understand that life is very unstable so it is the only duty to to drink that nectar we will have to arrange that nectar in our life so esha buddhi matam buddhi manisha cha manishinam यत सत्यम अनृते नेह अमृतेन अपनति अमृतम दिस लाइफ इज वेरी अनस्टेबल मोस्ट अनस्टेबल एंड विद द हेल्प ऑफ दिस बॉडी विद द हेल्प ऑफ दिस माइंड वी विल हैव टू अरेंज आवर इटरनल बेनिफिट हाउ विद द हेल्प ऑफ गुरु विष्णु विद द हेल्प ऑफ गुरु विष्णु यू कैन इजीली अरेंज सो गुरु विष्णु कैन have two type of sarup one is very secret sarup and another is banchanama is a real, real sarup depriving sarup another is genuine sarup all pure guru vaishnav even bhagwan that is their speciality supreme lord can cheat very easily ha eh? that's why supreme lord writing in gita you see is speaking ये यथा मं प्रपद्यंते तं सथैव भजाम्य अहम वेरी क्लेवर सुप्रीम लॉर्ड स्पीकिंग दैट आई कैन पे अकॉर्डिंग टू देयर यू नो सेवा आई कैन पे देम आई कैन पे देम अकॉर्डिंग टू देयर सेवा आई कैन पे देम गो 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 टेक विद दिस मूड यू वांटेड टू सेव मी सो आई एम गोइंग टू गिव यू रिटर्न 
दे जाए सो इट्स क्वाइट नेचुरल सुप्रीम लॉर्ड कैन चीट यू गुरु वैष्णव कैन ऑल्सो चीट यू यू कैन रिमेम्बर वेन एटीन टाइम्स वेन एटीन टाइम्स प्रभुपाद वॉज रिफ्यूज बाय श्री गौर की सदर बाबा जी महाराज Prabhupada wanted to take diksha from this Paramahansa Gurudev, Gaur Kishan Das Baba Ji Maharaj, by the advice of Sila Sachidananda Bhakti. When one by one, totally eighteen times he was refused by Gaur Kishan Das Baba Ji Maharaj. Last time, all the time Gaur Kishan Das Baba Ji Maharaj speaking. Okay, I forget. I can ask permission from Gaur Hari. You can come next day. This way, one by one, uh, day by day, Gorke Sir Baba Ji Maharaj started cheating. Then uh, the last time, Gorke Sir Baba Ji Maharaj uh, in front of Gorke Sir Baba Ji Maharaj, Sila Pohpal Bimala Pusat crying and speaking. Well, you are doing bhajan of Krishna, who is the number one cheater. So you are going to cheat me. You need not give the cha to me. I am going to jump into Ganga. Then Gaur ki sir Baba Ji Maharaj Rani, come, 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 my Prabhu, come, come, stop, stop. I can give the cha to you. So you see, people think the cha is a very joking matter. There is no the bhagyan. What to speak about the bhagyan? I wrote much before, ten, twelve years back, some protest notebook. That what to speak about Dibbo Gyan? They have no common sense. Dibbo Gyan ka kya kahena hai? Common sense tak nahi hai. Hein? Kando Gyan in Bengali we say Dibbo Gyan to durer kotha. Kando Gyan hi tha der kono holo na. They have no common sense. Kando Gyan. So how we can expect that they have? They have taken diksha thirty years back, so the so they are doing all nonsense at present. That is the symptom of their dibbogyan. Eh? One or two example can be quoted here, which can help you to understand this point. How exclusive honor and respect was shown. By Sela Pahupat to ex Basudev. It is not our program to fight with anybody. It is our desire to unveil the secrecy related to Hari Bhajan. So, how exclusive way honor and honor and respect was shown by sila pahupa to ex basudev the so called ganesh of of sila pahupa or why vidya vinod you can go through the past history of gauriya mat you can discover a title ganesh was conferred given to ex basudev also vidya vinod ha eh? this title the great editor of the gauriya patrika this title was given to subodh saha subodh saha sundarananda ji so often sela prabhupad used to glorify their name in front of public in such a way prabhupad used to speak in front of public that common man can cannot get any smell of banchana that prabhupad going to cheat them because they are cheater so common people they cannot trace out no smell they cannot get they can get no smell So sometimes Sila Pohpal also used to offer some monetary benefit to some of his sevaks. Sometimes Sila Pohpal used to offer some monetary benefit to some of his sevaks to prove his exclusive love for them. But that was a big banchana moilila. 
that was a big banchana they could never realize this point so guru vaishnav sometime you know can sometime can express that that kind of mood of banchana so guru vaishnav can sometime offer some title so guru vaishnav can some guru vaishnav sometime can offer some title or honor or monetary facility can give monetary facility to me is quite natural you can remember one shloka you was discussing that about you know devi maiya दोषान परेशा ही गुणेशु साधव गृहती कचि न भवादृशा द्विज दोषान परेशा ही गुणेशु साधव गृहती कचि न भवादृशा द्विज गुणाश्च फलगुण बहुली करिष्णव महात्मस्तेषु अविद्वान घम यू कैन रिमेम्बर दि श्लोक गुरु वैष्णव प्योर गुरु वैष्णव दे आर सो मर्सिफुल सो merciful they are so pure they can never find any fault with me whereas i am full of faults they say no you are very good eh you can do nice hari bhajan come to me this way they can deprive so what wrong in it if some guru vishnu is going to give some big honor to me honor to me title to me eh they can do it that doesn't mean that is a permanent certificate pobad used to offer this kind of certificate to some of his disciples before he used to give big big titles but later on life they all fall down when guru vaishnav going to speak in front of me that you are a great devotee so and i should understand they are giving me indication that i am fallen soul i will have to come up to the level of great devotee this is the right conception otherwise they are going to cheat me and i can you know get a you know big you know wrong siddhanta so guru vaishnav can guru vaishnav some time can offer some title or honor big big honor you are yoga acharya Diva, this, that, you know. Now, is this this way? They can see, they can say, but that doesn't mean that I am already. I am really a big monkey. Guru Vishnu can give title to me. They can speak. Sakta be sabata, this, that, so many title they can speak to cheat me, but that doesn't mean that I am really a big monkey. so establishment of countless math mandirs try to follow this point siddhanta so establishment of countless math mandirs and making countless disciples etc is not is not the clue is not the clue to substantiate great vaishnavism with somebody to substantiate great vaishnavism in somebody says so this is not the procedure not that so establishment of countless math mandirs and making countless disciple etc is not the evidence not the clue to substantiate about the vaishnavism of somebody the degree of vaishnavism on the other hand i like to speak that the degree of vaishnavism of anybody is only pivoted on the single point of siddhanta vichar what is that vichar what is that point what is that point 
the degree of vaishnavism of anybody is only pivoted on the single point of siddhanta vichar what is that siddhanta vichar how much love how much respect how much affinity and dedication is there with anybody for sadhu guru vaishnav how much love how much respect how much affinity how much dedication i have for guru vaishnav bhagwan hari naam how much taste i am getting this is the only pivoted point on the basis of which you can arrest a non devotee this is the thermometer this thermometer is more than sufficient to detect the heart of any to detect the heart of any vaishnav or to detect the heart of any non vaishnav a vaishnav aparadhi to know about his vaishnavism anyway in the long run a kapat sadhu cannot hide his dangerous incurable heart disease of jealousy must charge ya against pure guru vishnu anyway in the long run a kapat sadhu maybe in the beginning is going to show respect and everything but when all big big guru vishnu have gone then he started to open his own dirty heart not before that very clever anyway in a long run a kapat sadhu cannot hide his dangerous incurable heart disease of jealousy master jawab against pure guru vishnu this is the perfect siddhanta established by sila bhakti siddhanta saraswati goswami tagur pahupad the following siddhanta vichar can give us an warning the following siddhanta vichar can give us an warning about this point some bhag from bhagavad gita mahapurana we can get one slok 7th canto 15th chapter 26 number of slok yasho sakshat bhagavati gyan deep prade guru marto swadhi srutam tasya sarvam kunjara saucabad try to follow this slok yasho sakshat bhagavati gyan deep prade guru मर्त साधी श्रुत तस्व कुंजर शौचवत वट इज मीन वट इज द मीनिंग ऑफ द स्लोक ही हू डेवलप्स हू कैन सो वेरी नेगेटिव आई मीन मेटेरियल कंसेप्शन इन साक्षात भागवत स्वरूप गुरु द डोनर ऑफ द deep gyan divine knowledge if any disciple going to foster i mean you know this kind of conception material condition conception very negative conception material conception about sakshat bhagavat sakshat bhagavat sarup guru the donor of the deep gyan for him all spiritual activities like shravana for him or spiritual for him all spiritual activities like shravana kirtana chanting etc including mantra diksha all become useless all become useless just like the bath of an elephant you know the other day i was speaking about the ml about the process eh uh, through which an elephant can take bath first of all can go to a very nice pond and with full enjoyment taking bath in the fresh water after coming out of the pond and going to a very dustful place and put taking all dust and by his tongue and throwing like powder Oh, whole body. <laughs> this is a system of bath. So it is this compared 
In Bhagavatam we see, Yasso Shakshad Bhagavati Gyan Deep Prade Guru Marto Swadhi Sutam Tasso Sarabam Kunjara Sauchavat. It is just like the butt of an elephant. What to speak more? All foolish people coming to join Goryamat. They are going to take Diksha. They like to take Sanyas. After that, they are going to arrange some problem. They want to set fire. And, and all the glories of Goryamat and Prabhupada and his mission. They like to set fire to project their own glories. So, Dibhagyan, for him, all activities, all activities like uh, Sravana, Kirtana, chanting, etc., including Mantra, Diksha, all become useless for him, just like the butt of an elephant. Now we must understand the gravity of Guru Bhavagya, Guru Bhavagya, or Vaishnava Parat. We must understand this point, Guru Bhavagya, Guru Bhavagya, Guru Bhavagya, or Vaishnava Pura or ten different kind of operas already listed there in Shastra. That is why Gurudev was very, you know, merciful. Gurudev says, Sila Bhakti Pramod Purigeshi Maharaj was so merciful, he wanted to compile one books through which all common people can avoid, through which they can have the chance to avoid Vaishnava Pura. They are so great Vaishnav, they are so great Vaishnav. Even at it is beyond our imagination. When the life history biography of Sila, when the life history of Sila Bhakti Vita Madhav Gosim Maharaj, first part was published, second part was published. Guru Maharaj giving me permission. I mean in I mean Guru Maharaj request I mean, giving instruction, you must go and collect this book. I like to go through this book. You see the reason eh? to teach me what kind of love and affection they have. When Siddhar Goswami is just sick, doing sick Leela, Guru Padma already knowing. He is running and running to see the lotus feet of Siddhar Goswami Maharaj. You see the love for God brothers. Satitta Piti Sadharmo Bhakti Vita Mahadukasi Maharaj's Pranam Mantra. There is no love for Guru Vaishnava. What kind of demon I am? Eh? So, so many cases I can speak about Bhakti Vita Mahadukasi Maharaj. But I, today I have no time, I can speak someday to prove to what kind of exclusive love for Guru Vaishnava. They had. So now we are going to ignore Guru Vaishnava. We want to insult Guru Vaishnava. We want to, you know, throw their books and Siddhantas. That is my Vaishnavism. So great Vaishnava I am. Guru Bhavagya, Vaishnava Parad. So to check out, you know, Guru Pat Padma was bound to write one book that is called. Vaishnav Aparad. The book was translated into English. The name of the book is, you know, The Heart of Krishna. So, now we must understand the gravity of Guru Bhavagya, Guru Bhavagya or Vaishnav Aparad. To check ourselves from doing different kind of Aparads, including Vaishnav eh, Aparad, all aparad, I mean nam aparad, dham aparad, all different kind of aparads are there. Before starting bhajan, we must understand those points. If I find my Gurudev going to give me instruction, don't go to hear group, pure Guru Vaishnava, then I can immediately reject that Vaishnava, my Gurudev. I can reject my Gurudev. It is the Siddhanta of Shastra. Jo bhakti nairahitam annayena sinatiya to ubho brajataha nirayam kalam akshayam. For infinity period. Also, Pitama Vishwa speaking, 
who is going to speak all rubbish without knowing what is good what is bad without judgment is going to speak all rubbish against me karja karjo majanata utpata patibanna sapari tyag vidhiyate that kind of guru should be you know left alone we are not going to cooperate swarup lakshan and tatastha lakshan sa de we can speak clearly about these two points what do you mean by swarup lakshan what do you mean by tatastha lakshan common people they don't understand these two points swarup lakshan and tatastha lakshan if you cannot understand swarup lakshan of guru vishnu only you can watch how much how my how many disciples made by my gurudev how much disciples countless you know disciples are there so many mats mandir mat mandirs this is not the only you know symptom there is not the only you know which are so i already explain you so what do you mean by sarup lakshan sarup lakshan of any object of any man it means the lakshan itself there inside his heart sarup lakshan means the lakshan symptom which is there already inside him tatas lakshan by some gazing you can understand okay he is doing this he is making so many temples may mat mandir so maybe he is very good great person so many people running behind a cheater so but common people get oh maybe he is very good person so so many people going guru patmanda used to give one very nice example one day guru patmanda going to ganga ghat eh in kalna that day that time guru mahas went kalna and the special that was a special day that is pitri paksha i mean mahalaya day all you know people going to offer funeral cake and water and to their forefathers in waters so one chakravarti is some important man he is going with his you know pot of water panchapatra or koshakushi you know to do this kind of ritualistic activities but he find so many people there they have the same you know pot panchapatra or kosakushi he was in great problem how to take bath if i put my pot here uh, somebody can think it is my pot they can go away then he thought it necessary is very important personality in kalna he thought is very so he thought that i must uh, put some ganga mat on my pot to identify very easily then he is putting ganga mat in his kosakushi and going to take bath in ganga after coming back he discover all the you know all pots all people putting ganga mat in all pots he was very surprised to see he was very surprised to see how it is possible that everybody putting mat so how i can understand what is my actual my pot this is the situation common people they are Go, they are you know like a flock of lamb you know lamb or goat one goat if you catch his ear and pull all other in the total team can follow so this is a system this is a system at present nobody going to understand what can be the actual reason so swarup lakshan and tatas lakshan of any vastu or any man uh, any devotee can be there so you must clarify this point what is the sarup lakshan of one vaishnav sarup lakshan of one vaishnav i already clarified tremendous love for guru vaishnav bhagwan hari naam nam prabhu be sure there is sarup lakshan all other lakshan is tatas lakshan like going to take bath in ganga daily you know you know doing our doing archan uh giving distributing prasadam making so many mats and mandir making disciple speaking you know you know harikatha to prove that i am a great vaishnav 
but out of realization he is not speaking so jivoga sempad i already told jivoga sempad speaking bhakta saraga niraga divido parikirtita so sarvaprakana tata salakyan by now you understand so so you can understand if i don't have any love and respect unto the lord of sita strong affinity unto the lord of sita guru vishnu and i have no attraction for hari naam prabhu in that case what kind of you know devotee i am you will have to think twice before paying dandava to me whereas i already discussed this point the siniva sajajyo speaking you know sinijya siniva sajajyo बलवान अदुरु यस्सु नसाद गुरु पदाम भुजे सुतोई रोपित अस्सु सशास्त्रैर कृष्णे भक्ति न जायते ही कैन नॉट गेट इवन ए ड्रॉप ऑफ कृष्ण भक्ति ही कैन शो एग्जिबिट शो मेनी थिंग्स इन फ्रंट ऑफ यू टू मेक फुल ऑफ यू बट ही कैन नॉट प्रूव दैट ही इज प्योर वैष्णव सो ऑल हिज एक्सटर्नल एग्जिबिशन ऑफ सेवा कैन कम टू ए फ्लॉफ एंड Because the first lakshan is sarup lakshan, whereas all other lakshan are tatusta lakshan. There is twenty-four different kind of you know qualities of Vishnu, but the pivoted quality, the center point of all qualities is Krishnoi ka saran, saranagati Krishnoi ka saran. There is twenty-six different kind of qualities of Vishnu, but this Sarup Lakshan one is that Krishna ka saran. Pashu pakhi hai tha ki shari ke bani rahe, tobo bhakti rahu bhakti bino do hi rahe. That is called Sarup Lakshan. If the most vital Sarup Lakshan of bhakti is not there. then all other qualities all useless all so business all so business i already told many time there is a siddhanta of chaitanya charitamrita that krishna bhak krishna shakti bina nahi bhakti pravartan krishna shakti bina nahi bhakti pravartan to install bhakti inside other inside the heart of other people you must have जैनविन कृष्ण भक्ति कृष्ण शक्ति मेन कृष्ण भक्ति सो इट इज रिटर्न इन चैतन्य चरतामित कृष्ण शक्ति बिना न ही भक्ति प्रवर्तन इफ कृष्ण भक्ति इज नॉट देयर इन साइड मी माई हार्ट हाउ आई कैन गो टू हाउ आई कैन गो फॉर प्रीचिंग हाउ आई कैन इंस्टॉल इन भक्ति इन साइड अदर पीपल some people going to make fool of us they are speaking it is the standing instruction of chaitanya mahaprabhu amar agai guru hoya taro ei desh amar agai it is my instruction that try to act as guru amar agai guru hoya taro ei dai to deliver our common people but they forget one vital point Mahaprabhu never told that way. What is the inner meaning of his instruction? Mahaprabhu told, "Amar agai guru hoya taro idesh." It is my instruction. First of all, you try to become guru. Try to take the asan chair of Guru Dev. Try to get all Vaishnava tickets, everything. Try to follow your. guru parampara perfect way because without guru parampara is not possible mahaprabhu also not going to ignore guru parampara so how i can how mahaprabhu can speak wrongly amar agai guru hoya taroi this means it is my instruction that you try, first of all you will have to become vaishnav guru jai vaishnav sai guru he is guru he is vaishnav he is vaishnav he is guru he is vaishnav not guru is not possible bhakti mr tagu speaking Vaishnav means guru, hundred percent. Maybe he is not in, going to initiate anybody, but through Hari Katha, through Kirtan, Gorgisar Baba Ji Maharaj, Pavupat, you know all Kishnadas Baba Ji Maharaj, 
they are all helping us they are acting as guru so actually krishna shakti bina nahi bhakti bavartan means amar agai guru haiya taro ei desh means first of all you try to try to go up to the level of guru charan the platform of gurudev then you can go and deliver people and for that bipra that was special case because mahaprabhu was there directly mahaprabhu going to translate power inside him that's why mahaprabhu gave my instruction you go and it is written in chaitanya charitamrita it was a usual procedure through which mahaprabhu started preaching massive way mahaprabhu not going to initiate anybody bhag mahapur speaking hari naam hare krishna hare krishna 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 hare hare hari ram hari ram 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 hari hari going and speaking eh mahapur running and speaking krishna ke sab krishna ke sab krishna ke sab pai hi mam krishna ke sab krishna ke sab krishna ke sab pai hi mam this way mahapur running but it was a system mahapur used to give power to somebody and giving us as you go that was special case but in our case we will have to get all power from guru patwadna guru parampara because supreme lord directly not going to give any keeper to anybody some special case was there so ignoring guru parampara ignoring guru varga i cannot come out successful i can go deep into the darkness of maya i can say in my lecture illusion maya maya is the only reason maya is the only reason of fighting maya is the only reason of all problem but then in that case i am also in maya then why i am going to criticize guru vaishnav at least i should stop like i already told the tulsidas bab tulsidas ji maharaj when somebody is speaking maharaj that sadhu always criticizing you all the time but tulsidas ji maharaj speaking i like to make one bhajan kutir for him in front of my bhajan kutir you don't understand what i mean to say he is going to criticize you all the time that is why i am speaking i like to make one bhajan kutir for him in front of my bhajan kuti why 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 because he can go on criticizing me he can go on uh, you know finding faults in me because i cannot see my faults he can go on finding faults with me i can have the scope i can get the scope to rectify myself and get perfection if you are going to speak that maya 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 is the only reason of all fighting then why you are going to fight you are also in maya then why you are going to speak that way at least you should go out of maya you are going to give instruction don't go for sadhu sangha this that why to install krishna bhakti inside the heart of other people is called actual preaching it is called actual preaching otherwise what is the what is the meaning of preaching what do you mean by preaching preaching doesn't mean cheating only you can make garbage in the whole world in the name of preaching in the name of harikatha in the name of in the name of establishing different modes ultimately nobody going to offer even one tulsi and flower without money if you pay 10000 rupees they can offer to see and flower and to lord of sweet they can do service but that is not bhakti you cannot prove you cannot prove that you are going to arrange for people bhakti it is not bhakti organization your organization not bhakti organization business organization it can only increase garbage in the whole world what do you mean by diksha first of all i like to understand what popad want to say 
Sela Prabhupada Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Goswami Thakur used to say that before going for preaching to others, proper preaching should be done in front of yourself. Try to understand this point. Sela Prabhupada, the Prabhupada, the Prabhupada used to say that way, that before going for preaching in front of others, before going for preaching to others, in front of other people, proper preaching should be done in front of yourself, first. If more than sufficient, if more than sufficient preaching already done by you in front of your, in front of yourself, if more than sufficient preaching already done by you in front of yourself, in that case, you can find your preaching already supported by your acharan, efficacy. So, your real self can come out readily. That is the secrecy. It is an automatic factor that you can get the backing. When you are not going to cheat people, when you are going, when you are hundred percent sincere, when you think my preaching is only possible by the mercy of Prabhupada and Guru Bhargava, Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Kusitakura and Guru Bhargava, otherwise who am I to preach? I am a fallen soul. Preaching is not at all possible. That kind of humble, humble attitude was expressed by Rai Ramananda in front of Mahaprabhu. Mahaprabhu was speaking, Oh, so, so nice, Varigata, you are speaking. Rai Ramananda was saying, Prabhu, I am an instrument. You are playing that instrument. So, in Chaitanya Charitamrita is written, Rai Mukhe Bhakta Swayam Gaur Rai. In the mouth of Rai Ramananda, Gaur Hari, he is Gauravi himself speaking and Gauravi also hearing. Also Bhaktivinoda Thakur writing, you can remember as a Gauriya Sadhu. Piyaya prem matta kori mare suno nijoguno gan. Hey Prabhu, you first allow me to drink all nectars and then when the sufficient nectar I am going to drink, then automatically I can, you know, have some satisfaction. And after that, I can also go on speaking Harikatha. Piyaya pem matta gori more suno nijoguno gan. Oh Prabhu, when I can think that Supreme Lord Himself singing, Nityananda Babu sitting inside me, He is singing the glory of Gauranga. Who am I? In that case, I am a real preacher. If I think I am a great preacher, all Gauriyamas and everybody, all failure there, be, you are not a preacher. You are totally failure in preaching. Your mood speaking, your mood speaking that you are totally failure in your preaching mood. You cannot come out successful in infinity period. Also, we should understand this point that if more than sufficient preaching already done by you in front of yours in front of yourself in that case you can get your you can find your preaching already supported by acharan efficacy that is the secrecy of preaching and bhajan it is an automatic factor you need not to do some acting. You need not go for some acting. It is an automatic factor. Also, we should remember the following sloka usually used, usually used by Sila Prabhupada to give the clear conception of Yukta Vairagya. Also, we should remember the following sloka usually used by Sila Prabhupada to give us the clear conception of Yukta Vairagya. Ana Sakta Sri Sayano Yathar Homopujanja the Dislok. Eh? Prapanjikataya Vidya Harisam Mandi Vastuno. I already 
you know, I already discussed. So without which, without Jukta Bairagya, without Jukta Bairagya, without the clear conception of Jukta Bairagya, all my preaching, all my preaching or Hari Bhajan can come to a flop end. Useless. The day, the day, the day I can understand that my preaching is itself a perfect bhajan. When I can realize, when I can understand, when I can realize from heart that my speaking Harikatha is nothing but the topmost servitorship of my Guru Varga. The day I can realize from heart that my preaching, my Harikatha is my perfect Hari Bhajan, then surely, then surely the full Kripa of Yukta Vairagya going to back me. Then surely the full Kripa of Yukta Vairagya going to give me backing fully. Otherwise, this kind of feeling is quite impossible. This kind of feeling is quite impossible. Those who are actual Gauriya devotees, those who are big, big exalted devotees, they never think that to go for Harikatha is wastage of time. They never think that. They never think that way. All our Guru Varga, Parambiya Siddhar Goswami Maharaj, Parambiya Keshav Goswami Maharaj, you can go through their life history, you can find. At the last moment, before going to leave body, Sri Siddhar Goswami speaking three, four times in a day Harikatha. Prana chajar sehit prachar. If there is no life, life means vitals of your life. Saranagati is not there. Then what kind of preaching you have done in your life? What kind of preaching? It is. Prana chajar sehit prachar. Pran means, Bhakti Mahatma is speaking, Shikhai Saranagati Bhakti Rupran. Life and the vital thing of prachar is saranagati. Submission, then automatically power, flame, power can come. And through me, Nityananda can arrange kripa to everybody. Through me, maybe. If I am 100% inclined. If submission is not perfect, then I cannot expect. Through me, Bhagavan cannot distribute Kipa to. So usually great, great Vaishnav, they are preaching. Uh, also there are so many cheaters are also they are preaching. In the name of preaching they are swing all rubbish. So this is the appropriate Siddhanta Vichara of Srila Prabhupada Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Goswami Thakur. But bonded preachers, those who are bonded soul, those who are going for preaching, useless preaching. So bonded preachers, they can use this preaching procedure as an effective instrument to collect lava, puja, patishta, kamini, kanchan. This, this much they can, they can do. So bonded preachers, bonded souls, those who are going for preaching to make disturbance all over the world, they can use this preaching procedure as an effective instrument to collect lava puja pratishtha, kamani kanchal, kanchan, this much they can do. Keeping this, keeping this profile, keeping, keeping this profile in front of common foolish public, they always busy to collect lava puja pratishtha, nothing else. To make full of, to make full of people, common people, to make fool of common people is the is their is their main program. Their main program is to make fool of people, foolish people. Always, always, every now and then, they like to make new new project. Always, every now and then, 
they like to make new new project so that in the name of different kinds of projects they can collect huge amount of donation to misuse properly i mean fancifully how much but the how much of that donation how much of that donation they are going to utilize properly who going to check the total account who going to check their account so they can run their right run their life fancifully how much of that donation they are going to utilize properly that is a question and at all who is going to check who is going to check their total account but what was the speciality with but what was the speciality speciality with sila bhakti siddhant saraswati goswami tagur popat what was the speciality with him if anybody if anybody would like to give some donation to him if anybody would if anybody would like to give some donation to sila pauba with a specific idea to utilize the amount for some specific reason then immediately sila pauba used to reject that donation i don't need donation you can go away if anybody would like to give some donation to sila prabhupad with a specific idea to utilize the amount for some specific reason then immediately sila prabhupad used to reject the donation you go away i don't need your donation that was the principle that was the principle of sila prabhupad why why sila prabhupad used to say that if that the sila popad used to say that it is my responsibility sila popad used to say that it is my responsibility to seek your spiritual benefit so how to utilize the amount in whatsoever that is my personal judgment you should not interfere you should not interfere in this matter if you at all if you at all have full faith in me then why not you leave the whole matter with me it is my responsibility in the name of in the name of spiritual mission or organization sila popad never allowed any kind of business Prabhupad never allowed any kind of business in the name of spiritual mission organization. Sila Prabhupad never allowed any kind of business. At present, we are going to follow. If at all, at present we are going to follow Prabhupad. Somebody can speak all rubbish against us. They can speak. how it is possible to run our mission if we are going to follow prabhupad it is not possible they are speaking that way <laughs> they are speaking that way they are from goriamat i have some doubt about them they are not they have no connection no smell of any connection with so in the in the name of spiritual mission organization sila prabhupad never allowed any kind of business guest house business bandara business or tourism business were not at all allowed that time at that time sela popad always wanted to prove that siddhanta vichar of sri krishna chaitanya mahaprabhu what is that siddhanta vichar বিষয়ের অন্ন খাইলে মলিন হয় মন মলিন মনেতে না হয় কৃষ্ণের কৃষ্ণের স্মরণ ইফ আই এম গোয়িং টু অ্যাকসেপ্ট দ্য প্রপার্টিজ অ্যান্ড ইউ নো এভরিথিং ফ্রম এ মেটেরিয়াল ম্যান মেটেরিয়াল রিচ ম্যান 
বিষয়ে অন্য খাইলে মলিন হয় মন ইফ আই এম গোয়িং টু টেক অন্য রাইস দেন আই ক্যান নট সিং দ্য গ্লোরিজ অফ চৈতন্য মহাপু আই ক্যান নট সিং হ্যারি কথা নট পসিবল ইফ আই এম গোয়িং টু লিভ অন মাধুকুরি ভিক্ষা দেন অ্যান্ড অনলি দেন ইট ইজ পসিবল ফর মি টু স্পিক হ্যারি কথা ইউ ক্যান রিমেম্বার when the father and the brother of father of raghunath das goswami hiranya govardhan they all used to serve guru vishnu all the time thousands of rupees at the time they used to spend they used to do guru vishnu seva but still that was not actual seva why mahaprabhu told they are not vaishnav they are like vaishnav vaishnav are pray try to think over and again the siddhanta now if somebody going to give me 10000 donation i am going to catch his leg oh maharaj you have given 10000 rupees donation you must take prasadam in the first row this is the situation we are going to give service we are servant of those material you know material rich man we are servant that's why in bhagavatam sukhdev goswami is shouting loudly like lion kasmad bhajanti dhano durma dandha why those sadhu going to catch the lotus feet of those you know materially blind people why i can discuss this point some day and today i have no time kasmad bhajanti kavayo dhano durma dandhan they are materially blind people why sadhu guru was not going to flatter eh krishna is not there the supreme lord infinity brahmanda is is playing with infinity brahmanda even muslim kavi poet can write e vishwa loye birat shishu an mone kheliso ho ho great child boy you are playing you in infinite you are playing with infinity world unmindfully e vishalo e virat shishu anamale kheliso so the siddhanta of chaitanya chaitanya is that vishoyir anno khaile molin hoy mon molin mone te na hoy krishna smaran map map prabhu himself speak if i am going to take the rise of some donor who is materially blind i already told the case of you know manindu chandra raja manindu chandra the other day so if my mind is not clean then i cannot speak hari katha siddhant all siddhant vichar all series wise cannot express appear in my heart so how i can speak hari katha if i cannot maintain my purity eh if my mind is dirty then i cannot remember krishna and krishna katha molin monete na hoy krishna smaran this is the siddhanta of sila pavapad only and only madhukuri viksha only and only madhukuri viksha was allowed at that time by sila pavapad you know you know nothing only and only madhukuri viksha was allowed at that time by sila pavapad sila pavapad used to say like lion by you know sila bhakti siddhant saraswati goswami pavapad used to say by the day and night effort by the day and night effort of those gauriya math devotees by the day and night efforts of those gauriya math devotees whatever amount is collected for the seva of sri sri radha govind gaur hari be sure that each and every penny of that total donation going to be utilized for the same purpose nobody going to enjoy even a single amount of money single amount single penny of that donation you see the open declaration by sri lopapat in the name of yukta vairagya all rabi is going on 
those who are mayavadis they in the guise of sadhu besha in the in the guise of sadhu guru vishnu always ready to arrange their own sense gratification also from the glorification of simad bhagavatam i mean from padma puran many time before i discussed this point shudram pratigrahishvanti tapavesho upajivinah dharmam bhakshanti adharmagya adiruro uttam asanam you should remember already predicted by vyasadev goswami shudra who is shudra shokam karoti ti shudra those who are always repenting i am going to lose this pranami i cannot get pratishtha uh, due to corona i am going to lose all different kind of donation i was supposed to get is called shudra shudra whereas hope at all any situation in which we are put into should be treated as the kripa of krishna we should be satisfied we should think that it is one kind of kripa on us tatte anukambam susamikshaman munyana eva atmakrita vipakam hridbag babuvir vidadat namaste jiveto bhakti padesha daivak jiveto mukti padesha daivak so sudram pratigrahishanti tapobej upajivinah do do jo sudra they are not at all devotee they are they are going to misuse the divine knowledge available in goriamart shudra pratigrahishanti they are going to take the vesha of sanyas to live on alarm they like to beg do to do give me give me donation you look i am sanyasi like ravana is coming am sanyasi bhiksham dehi where is kapat shudra pratigrahishanti tapabe supojivinah dharmam bhakshanti adharmagya adhirura uttam asanam so shudra they are going to going to collect big amount of donation to live their life very peacefully they like to enjoy their life and those who are fallen so they are not at all dharma they are not a dharmic they are not pious man religious man they are going to speak hari katha dharmam bakshanti adharmagya like durjadhan adiruro uttam asanam they are going to decorate they are going to take the asan of best day best asan that is why you can remember jiva go sai pa always giving reminder don't try to do that you can contaminate the whole system whole parampara you can contaminate be careful but try to remember this perfect siddhanta vichar that without the application of without the application of without the application of siddhanta vichar or principle of sila paupad and bhakti vinod thakur we can never run a gauriya mart we can never a gauriya mart it is not possible for any rich man to run a gauriya mart it is not possible but they think so they are fighting with me not now at present previously i mean maybe 20 years back between the same haraj he is speaking this way how it is possible for us to run gauriya mart if we are going to follow propat you say how we can say this you are from gauriya mart whereas propat and guru varga used to say without the like, without the application of all siddhant vichars and principles without the application of the principles of propat nobody can run a gauriya mart in true sense they can run a society blind society blind society is governed by blind society is run by blind society can be controlled by blind peoples andha yathan dai rupa niyamanam teyo pisi chananta murudam nibadda prahlad mara speaking that much they can they can they can get that much facility they are going to misguide whole world they are going to reach hell 
very quickly with all their followers. Be sure about it. Any amount of society formation, any amount of legal steps are not possible at present to run a mart properly. Now at present, they are going to complain that it is quite impossible to run Gauriya Mart on the basis of the instruction issued by Sila Prabhupada. Those idiots, they are speaking that way. They are actually businessmen. So they are speaking this way. Blind men, going to blind others. Blind people, they are guided by blind. How they can say like this? This can prove that they have no connection with Goryamat. No smell of connection of Goryamat is there with them. A Saraswat Gauriya devotee, a Saraswat Gauriya devotee can never speak that way. Why they are going to contaminate the whole Saraswat Gauriya society? Why not they, why not they go away from the society to at least stop contamination? That is our question. How, without the application of the principles and ideas of Sila Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Goswami Thakur Prabhupada, without the Siddhanta Bichar of Sila Prabhupada, Goryamat can never be run. Nobody can run a Goryamat. They forget this point. They forget this point. That's why they are going to make mistake again and again. They are going to misguide the whole society. They are going to misguide the whole world. If the truthfulness, now my question is that, if the truthfulness, if the truthfulness is the, is the basic platform of your bhajan, you have come to do bhajan, na? Why you have come to Goryamat? To do Hari bhajan, na? So if that if truthfulness is the basic platform of your bhajan, then why if truthfulness is the basic platform of your bhajan, then how, why you like to hide the absolute truth? Why you become angry with me? Because I am speaking all about this absolute truth. And also, we will have to look now, present, at present, we will have to do a detailed survey of the present situation. Also, we will have to look into the situation that time. I mean, at the time of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, Krishna Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. You can find in Chaitanya 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 Bhagavad all authentic scriptures how thousands of devotees they are trying to serve Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. They are automatically harmonized. They have no fighting with each other. How exclusive way they are going to serve Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. Or their common goal is to satisfy the Supreme Lord Sri Krishna Chaitanya Mahaprabhu from heart. That is the only goal they all they had. So they wanted to satisfy Chaitanya Mahaprabhu anyhow, at any cost. That is why the great harmony was there. So all thousands of devotees they are automatically harmonized. We can say they are all singing, dancing, laughing, embracing each other, taking prasadam, doing sankirtan. Why? They are all harmonized already. Whereas we are going to start a new society, we are going to start a mat, mandir, we are going to set up GBC members, everything, so legal, you know, actions we are going to take. So many members, 
they are all blind they are all block headed personalities they think we are intelligent they are going to take all ravi siddhanta like political leader they are going to kill themselves are going to they are going to kill all those followers how it is not possible at present whereas we are making all different society formation all different kind of legal actions we are going to take but still we are failure to run a society very smoothly quite natural how you can run your society first of all your society is material society to do business is your you know only goal second point those material people are all they are they are gbc members all material people they are not shuddha bhakta 100% they are all blind people they are going to guide give guidance they are going to pass remarks about the present situation they cannot find any solution they cannot find any solution because bhakti is the only solution you can remember i can discuss so many points now i know baba speaking my guru path padma paramang sasto externally you cannot find any education with him but be sure all the gist all the outcome of all the teachings about shastras could be found in applied form in my guru path padma that is the excellency externally you cannot find my guru path padma is educated but be sure any problem any problem pertaining to this infinity world my guru path padma can find a flawless solution of any problem my guru path padma can find a flawless solution of any problem any kind of problem can speak very easily can solve because bhakti is there krishna is there inside his heart so usually i used to quote this example if i want to draw one circle pivot it on a point i fix it on a paper and draw one circle with compass an instrument of geometry so i can draw one circle after that i can i can draw countless circle if i change slightly by changing slightly 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 by changing the radius i can make countless circles center point is same no circle going to cut any other circle but as soon as i am going to change 1.001 mm mm the center i am going to change center point then immediately i can discover the circle i am going to draw it can cut it can cut all other circle i already drawn before what do you mean i mean to say if all our goal is common to satisfy supreme lord if there is any common goal all sanyasis all over the world if we all have the same goal it is not one kind of acting i i like to i mean so really so if there is one and a single goal immediately i can discover there is nice harmony we can discover no fighting with each other at present fighting going on because each and every gbc members everybody they like to project their own you know interest they like to project their own you know interest they like to seek their own interest so automatically there is no common center point so automatically fighting is a must nobody can stop nobody can stop nobody can stop so this is the situation so this is the situation at present nobody can stop fighting because if at all i have bhakti if at all i have love then i can give harmony i have seen in my own life guru pat padma sila bhakti pramod purugeshima sitting in a old age 
you know, he is sitting in his own bed, half sleeping, cannot even sit properly. But I have seen how nice harmony was there. Simply Guru Padma was there. Guru Maharaj used to love me. Guru Maharaj used to love me. Guru Maharaj used to bless me. One nice, you know, glance of Guru Maharaj's face, you know, lotus feet, smiling face was more than sufficient to get consolation. If somebody going to chide me, speaking all rubbish against me, then naturally I used to feel, oh, why are you speaking this way? But when I reach the lotus feet of Guru Padma, all problem gone. Guru Padma used to give one example from Bhagavatam. My son, never mind. This is material world. You cannot expect this kind of, you know, you know, perfect behavior, ideal behavior from each and everybody. They all bonded so, yeah. So, you can expect from Guru Vaishnava. But if you go, if you can remember the, in, the if, you can, if you can remember the case of, you know, Tirandi Bhikshu, Guru Padpani used to, you know, speak that, the case of Tirandi Bhikshu from Bhagavatam. Guru Maharaj speaking, you can remember my song, how people going to insult him, how going to, ins how people going to, you know, insult him, speak all rubbish against him, but still, he is not feeling any inspiration to speak anything against anybody, because he took resolution, Sanyas Brata, Mauna Brata, you know, etam samasthaya paratmanishtha purvata nera maharsvi aham tariswami duranta param tamaha mukundangri nishimba yivo. Mukundangri, Guru Mahatmanda used to speak this slok and, you know, used to give this example. You should always remember my song about the case of that tirandi bhikshu to grow your tolerance. If you can grow your tolerance extremely, then surely you can become a pure Vaishnava. Surely you can distribute kipa among thousands of people. Maybe they are going, they can try to kill you. They, they can try to, you know, avoid you at present. But someday they can realize, really, really, he never wanted to cheat us. He wanted to give all about that absolute truth. We are so foolish. We are so foolish. We wanted to avoid him. It is our fault. That is why Jagannath Das Babaji Maharaj is speaking. How bad luck! How bad luck! All oh, common people, those you know, pure Guru Vaishnav, they are speaking so heavily. They are speaking so heavily to drive away the Maya from the heart of common people. They are speaking so heavily. It is one kind of medicine. They are speaking so heavily in front of common people to drive away Maya from their heart. They are going to help them to attain perfection. But unluckily, so unlucky they are. They think those Guru Vaishnav, they are enemy, our enemy. They are enemy. We like to boycott them, their Harikatha. We like to boycott their association. Well, it is your own privilege. You can do and find yourself in hell. You can do it while it concerns to me. So this way, one by one, I can go on speaking all about the glories of Srila Prabhupada and his exclusive Siddhanta, evolution. It is revolting. You know, you will have to hear, you will have to dis distribute this Harikatha, share. Thousands of people all over the world, all devotees, they are new devotees, those who are old devotees, they, are, they, they should understand all the perfect Siddhanta of Srila Prabhupada to protect themselves from ruin. They are going to invite total destruction in their life. They are going against Goryamat and the elevated devotees of Goryamat. All great great devotees, Srila Siddhar Goswami Maharaj, Srila Bhakti Pramod Puri Goswami Maharaj, Sila Parambhya Kesav Goswami Maharaj, Sila Bhakti Padip Tittha Goswami Maharaj, Sila Bhakti Rakak, Bhakti Rakak, Bhakti, you know, Vedha Banodev Goswami Maharaj, Bhakti Mahi Bhagavad Goswami Maharaj, 
Bhakti Gora Baikhanas Goswami Maharaj, all great, great devotees, they are all jewels. Who told you? Who told you? Who told you? Not to attend their Harikatha, not to attend their Harikatha, not to go through their... Who told? Who? We want to cut his name from the list of Vaishnav forever, infinity before. Balaram can cut his name from the list forever, I think so. So, no mercy he can get, no kipa. He is going to lose his life forever, infinity pure. Gauranga gatir baja sritamati si gauradhama sthiti. Gauranga gatir baja sritamati si gauradhama sthiti. Sasasaika bitir kushanga virati. Dusto vetha niskriti. Siru paikarati shanatana nati. Siji vate jostati. Shishi Danta Sarasati Vijayate Gauriya Goshti Pati Shishi Danta Sarasati Vijayate Gauriya Goshti Pati Sujanar Budharadito Pado Jugam Jugadhar Madurandar Patro Varam Baradhavayadaya Kapuya Padam Ponamami Sada Prabhu Pado Padam Ponamami Sada Prabhu Pado Padam Ponamami Sada Prabhu Pado Padam We all going to pray unto the lotus feet of all, all our Guru Varga and specially unto the lotus feet of Prabhupada to bless us to understand bhajan. Vaan chha kalpa turvusya ki pasindh bhavusya patitanang pavana bhavusya bhyo namo namo.